the place for comic book and anime reviews. Hey there you guys, welcome to Burger King 12 YouTube channel. Play for your comic book and anime reviews. Today is my review for Orient, episode number nine. So this episode of Orient, we get to see the return of Musashi in a really, really big way in this episode. Uh, he's finally uh, kind of moved past the whole Kitetsu Blade thing that we got in the last episode, uh, where he was trapped inside the Kitetsu Blade and he couldn't really like use its power. Um, in this episode, we kind of get the kind of ending of that where he's kind of in this in-between state now where he can't use the power of the Kodetsu Blade, but it isn't like outright rejecting him like it was before in the last episode um, where it was really saying to him like, no, you cannot use me. You cannot use me. No matter what you do, um, you cannot use the Kodetsu Blade because you're not the one who should have it pretty much and he hasn't done the thing where the other guy has done who's our antagonist of this episode where he has become the Kotetsu blade and has let it fully integrate into him to give him more power I'm um, actually not done that he wants friends he wants people who will love him um, he has a kind kindred spirit uh, he and the Kotetsu blade kind of saw that he doesn't he wants this for his friends. He wants to be there for people and help them. And I think that's a really sweet and um, noble thing that Masashi is doing. And I think that's why he's in this middle ground uh, with, the, with the blade. And so the Kazabai can probably make his choice to either completely take him over and for him to become the Kotetsu blade or for him to give her the power so that way he can use it to help his friends. And we'll see where that goes going forward and if it has like a really bad effect or if it goes a dark, it takes a dark turn, it takes a light turn. We'll see what happens in the next few episodes. But uh, yeah, the return of Masashi was really great. In this I really, really enjoyed it. I love the action scene. I love the battle we got to see within it. I love the antagonist and his um, sidekick he basically uses and how she's not like... Um, Cause like when they when we first meet her, she isn't like being very evil or hostile towards him. Uh, and it's not really until she really has to be where she actually like starts fighting. I thought that was a really interesting dynamic where we got like uh, again the my character creates these really dynamic, really interesting antagonists. They're like more than just like your typical squirrel elite evil villain types, or even your um, complex doing this for the right thing types. They have a lot more dimension to them I would say and I thought that was a really interesting and really played well within this episode uh, and you know a lot of this episode was really good I thought um, the character motion was really great I thought the interaction were really great and I thought even the action this episode was pretty solid um, despite everything so very much my thoughts on this episode of Orient. I thought it was a really good episode of Orient and I can't wait to see where the next episode goes going forward so those are my thoughts on this episode you guys the comment on this episode of Ori, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.